Welcome back. Well, now we're giving you a chance to give back. Potential loving pets are being euthanized in record numbers because of overcrowding in shelters, and we're trying to combat that by finding good homes for some of these animals. Joining us right now is Fred Saunders from Animal Samaritans. Good morning. Good thank morning, you so Gloria. much for joining us this morning. Well, thank you for having us. And you have a very special furry friend yes, there, Sophie. Yes, this is little Sophie. Little Sophie is three years old, little terrier mix. She's just as pleasant as can be, and she likes to play. She likes children. Really a very good family dog. She is so calm, too. And, and she's, she's so calm. calm. She walks very well on a leash, by the way. She likes to be pet, right. of course. This is one of our rescue animals. Uh, we'll rescue and adopt out about 1,500 animals in about 12 months' time. Wow. And a lot of these animals we get from the city's county animal shelter mm. and uh, some other places, but uh, that's our main source. Besides people relinquishing their pets and so forth, want to find them a good home and give them a good life. Definitely. Now, Sophie, how did you find her? Do you know her story? Yeah, Sophie is actually from the city's animal shelter mm -hmm. uh, located in Thousand Palms. It's managed by the Riverside County. And we do have a cooperative program with them to get animals out and get them good homes. Okay. And so, Sophie, uh, what, what type of an owner would be good for Sophie if somebody... Oh, this is a family, this is a family dog. Uh, definitely somebody with children. But uh, without children, it would be okay. But she's a really a playful dog, and she's very, very calm, very even-tempered. Very even-tempered, And she likes, yeah. other, she likes other animals. Oh, that's good. Sometimes I know I have two little dogs, and they, mm. they don't always get along with other animals, so that's a, a plus. I have three pugs, and sometimes they get in squabbles. But uh, <laughs> no, she would be very good with other animals as well. Great. Now, if somebody wants to adopt a pet, um, mm -hmm. What recommendations do you give them to find the right match for them? Well, we have an adoptions counselor at uh, Indian, uh, at, excuse me, at a Thousand Palms, mm -hmm. at our facility on Ramon. And she's very, very good at interviewing people to find out if they're a good match. Uh, people wishing to adopt an animal, do, they do have to make out an application. They do have to be interviewed mm -hmm. just to make sure. Uh, we don't want the animal back. Sometimes that happens, though. Because so. it is important to make sure that the owner is going to be a good match for right. the dog and vice versa. It's right. very important. Now, sometimes we find that people come in, they want an animal so badly, they're not the right match or um, uh, they're in a situation where they really can't have the dog and then we get them back. We don't want that. Yeah, we don't want that. Well, Fred, thank you so much for joining us as always. And, thank of you. course... Sophie is looking for a home, so if you're interested in adopting Sophie, please look at the information on your screen. Or if you're interested in adopting another pet, of course, you can always contact them there right. at that information. And, and we'll be right back.